Good morning, everybody. Hi, Noah. We are making, oop, I didn't print it out. Rice crispy Earth. Look at Emma saving the day. Woo! So what you'll need is your Rice Krispies. You will need marshmallows. Since I'm heating my marshmallows up in the microwave, I don't need butter, but if you want to do it on the stove, you can have butter. And food coloring. And then I have like three bowls going. I separated my Rice Krispies into two bowls because we're going to have a blue one and then we're going to have a green one. Sammy, you're smart. I try. <laughs> I try. I didn't even think about that. Because <laughs> I know the directions say like mix them to like you put make the rice crispy ball and then you figure out the color uh -huh. i figured this would this would be a lot easier to separate the colors before uh, they get mixed together so what do i do first um, you can separate your rice krispies. I'm gonna get my uh, marshmallows started. That crackle pop. <laughs> How do you think they decided who got to be snack crackle and pop? I don't know. I think that they just didn't know the name. And then once they poured milk in it, they just listened to it. Right. <laughs> True. Um, do I use a whole box or just like half a box? I used my whole box just because I have a smaller box. Okay. But I guess it just depends on how many you want. We, if I put the marshmallows in and it looks like there's not enough Rice Krispies, then I'll throw more Rice Krispies in. Okay. And then I need to start microwaving my marshmallows, right? Yeah. Like a half a bag? Uh, maybe. Depends, the on how, ones. depends on how much. Uh, maybe I'll have a bag with half my box and then if I need more. Right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. And then I'm doing like two minutes. Yeah, I threw mine in for three and I'll probably check it every minute and a half. I should have started this before. I'm sorry. I didn't. Oh, I didn't. I didn't think about it before either. I was just like, okay, Rice Krispies. I made sure everything was all set up in my, in my kitchen. Didn't yeah, think about the cook process. Hold well, on. At least we get to hang out with Noah, and we get to hang out with each other longer. So it's perfect. Yeah. Did you do anything fun for Earth Day? I did. I planted a tree at my house. Um, I know. And I planted some garlic and potatoes. And my dad and I walked around the block and picked up garbage. Ooh. Yeah. And I made sure that everyone at Angelina's last night recycled. So I was like, you guys, you, I know it's a big trash can and we're in a restaurant. Oh, is that her celery? It's her little celery. That is so cute. <laughs> So it just grows from the bottom. Yeah. So all I did is says to cut it about an inch and a half, two inches. Like uh -huh. as you're eating your normal celery, you just cut it and then throw it in water. You'll have to change the water every once in a while because of uh, <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's so puffy. That is so fun. Okay, so kind of mix, and then where do I put it? All right, we are going to take, oops, let me move my celery. Can I eat it if I'm the only one eating it? You can, but it feels like it's pretty hot. 
Yeah, should have told me that before. <laughs> Careful, everybody, it's hot. We're just gonna take half. You're gonna separate it between your two bowls. Ooh, it smells so good, it's so sweet. Okay, drive safe. Bye, Sean. Oh my gosh, it's so sticky. I'm not looking forward to cleaning this. <laughs> I would let it soak in hot water. Okay. Yeah, that's that's a for sure. Either I forgot how gooey these were, or maybe this is, it's like re being, becoming a child again. <laughs> and it's nostalgic. And then I add the food coloring to it, right? Yep, right on top of the marshmallows. I'm gonna do three. Oh, you can start to hear them crackle. Whoa. Do it. Ah. <laughs> it's stuck everywhere. I'm starting to harden. <laughs> I know it's like you gotta go fast, huh? Sorry, we have distance learning happening over here. We got multiple. We have multiple di distance learning. Okay, this is what's happening. I told you, I like messy. Yeah, Rice Krispies all over the floor. Oh no. All right, I think we're gonna go in hands deep. I'm trying, it's hard. Careful when you move to your new color, because that's what just happened. I was used to the. the ah! <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, my goodness. Let me see. OK. Well, that's fine. Whoa. Hands are green. So, Miss Sammy, what do you think makes the marshmallows so sticky? I'm just curious. I would think all the sugar. Huh? I think all the sugar. So, if you want to use your hands, I would suggest spraying with a little bit of cooking spray. Cause that's what I just did, and it's not as bad. Huh? See, this is why you cook. Cause I was sitting there like. <coughs> My blue does not look very blue. have to add more colors as you go. I don't think we're going to get very bright colors. Oh, the blue is so pretty, though. Okay, so I have my blue mixed in and my green. Do I start making my own little balls of together? Yeah. Huh. Oh, and this would be a great part. So when you get your hands in there, definitely make sure to have cooking spray. Oop. 
It's my first Earth. <laughs> there we go. You got the blue up here. You got the green. They're so cute. I don't think I put enough green in it, though. Well, it might be one of those you would have to, uh, as you're melting your marshmallows, put your colors in there to mix it in the marshmallows, maybe? I could see that. To give it a more vibrant color. Or I think there's those marshmallows that do have separated colors. I think there's like pink and greens and whites and stuff. Uh -huh. So that might even work. I've seen ones where you melt chocolate and you just like dip it in chocolate or you paint it on there. Yeah. Yay! Oh no, my hands are bright blue and green. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only thing about food coloring. Oh yeah. But hey, the messier, the merrier, the food. All right. Well, I'm kind of nervous that I might need to start soaking mine. What do you think, my hands? And how many do I make out of it? I'm not too sure because depending on the sizes will give you different ones. Oop, and I think mine just keep getting bigger and bigger as I pull. <laughs> because here's my first one compared to the one I just made. <laughs> <laughs> how are yours, Noah? They look fine? Okay, there's another guy. He's cool. He looks more like a different side of the earth. This was a good idea to separate the colors, though. I could see that. Yeah. Go check your class. Make sure you need to be in class. See, stage, this can be part of your breakfast too. <laughs> For days. <laughs> right? All right, I'm out of Rice Krispies, but I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight Earths. Oh no, I still got a bunch of Rice Krispies left to do. Well, I just figured if I did the whole box, I'd eat the whole box. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, probably not my smartest move yet. Okay. okay, so putting your bowl in hot water does help. Soaking it? Yes, because here's the bowl that I just had. Like, it's almost all gone. Oh, wow. Okay. But definitely soak your, soak your utensils. Mommy, can I oh. Are you going to do a taste sample with me? I am. All right. I'm going to take the little one. Okay. It was pretty solid, too. Mm-hmm. That's the best tasting earth I've ever had. Can I, I love it. Mm -hmm. awesome. Thank you for such a fun idea. Thank you for joining me. All right. I appreciate it. That was fun. Thank you, Miss Sammy. Bye. Remember to send your guys' uh, pictures of your earths in. Will do. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye.